Tom and in today's tutorial I want to show you how you can globally disable comments for your WordPress website and so I'm running a local version of WordPress here uh, so let's go ahead and hop into the admin dashboard so a couple of quick things now um, some of you may be thinking well that's pretty easy disable comments I mean for a post yeah you can actually do that so if you go to a post and you click add new um, in the post area there are a couple things there are screen options and you can click on that discussion there so click screen option go to discussion and then when you scroll down you can actually uh, check there to allow comments or allow trackbacks and trackbacks and pingbacks say that fast five times um, for for a given page but here's the problem that's only at the singular level of that of that page so that's at the most atomic level of a post or a page or um, any uh, any media that you add because you can also do it for media as well um, that being said if you wanted to do this globally across the many different uh, WordPress types uh, so post types um, then what you can do is go to plugins add new and there is a plugin called disable comments you guessed it and so we will search for disable comments and there it is we'll install it now and then there are a couple others that you can look at but this is the one that I'm going to going to use for this tutorial and the one that I use personally um, on my site so now it is activated and there you can see it says disable comments here you can go into settings and here you can say disable all comment related controls and settings in WordPress so if you wanted to disable everything globally you could do that there or if you only wanted to disable on certain page or post types rather so pages media uh, we have an FAQ section um, but technically it's going to always be post pages and media and then whatever um, additional post types you have uh, for your WordPress website uh, but you can disable that by you know let's say you didn't want to disable the post but you wanted to disable pages you could do that there um, and it wouldn't it would basically disable that for pages and pages only and so let's let's try that on pages so we'll save and so if we go and I'm gonna open a new tab and we're gonna have it load that page option And it's still loading, I believe. There it is. So it loaded. And then you don't even see comments listed there in screen options anymore, nor do you see it listed anywhere there. Now, if we go back and I uncheck that and I click save, and we go back and we'll refresh this page, go to screen options. Now you see discussion is back. So the discussion is back as well as that whole discussion control um, is back. So that shows you how well this plugin works. And so it's a plugin that I like to go to oftentimes if you know I run across a project that just says, hey, I don't need any comment related controls available. So this is where uh, this is the plugin that I use and I go to. So I hope this helps you out if you have questions about using the plug in or comments please drop them below the video also please feel free to subscribe to the YouTube uh, channel for kickstart commerce whereby I release a video about search marketing WordPress tips and tricks and domain investing and domain uh, development strategies and ideas to grow your business so I release a video every Wednesday afternoon so please subscribe so you'll be notified of that as well as head over to kickstartcommerce.com and in the right hand uh, sidebar or in the sidebar rather on the right you will find a newsletter subscription um, form go ahead and fill that out complete that so you can be notified and have these tutorials drop right into your inbox every Wednesday afternoon so uh, I hope this tutorial helps you and uh, I look forward to seeing you on the next tutorial thanks that's all for now